Well, scientists say seismic activity has decreased in southwest Iceland, where hundreds of people have had to leave their homes over fears over a volcanic eruption. Iceland, known for its serene lands and the Viking or Norse history. is home to some of the most active volcanoes in the world. The island, between Greenland and Norway, near the Arctic Circle, boasts a terrain full of breathtaking meadows, waterfalls, mountain ranges, and glaciers, including the substantial Vatnajökull. However, a recent discovery in Iceland has caused a stir in the scientific community, sparking both fascination and concern. Could this newfound discovery reshape our understanding of Iceland's geothermal marvels or unveil hidden threats beneath the surface? Join us as we explore what just emerged at Iceland that has terrified scientists. Recently, in the serene landscape of Iceland, a discovery has emerged that has both intrigued and alarmed scientists. This revelation, found in the historically rich area near the small town of Adi in Rangervalam, has opened a new chapter in understanding Iceland's geology and history. The initial find was made during a standard archaeological excavation by the Archaeological Institute of Iceland. What they unearthed was a previously unknown man-made cave believed to date back to the Viking era. This discovery was not only unexpected, but also significant due to its potential historical value. The excavation, which first began in 2018, revealed a much larger cave system than initially anticipated. Connected to a broader network of underground structures, Local experts and historians believe these caves could be Nautahelir, medieval barns used for livestock and horses. The size and complexity of the cave system suggest it was an integral part of the community in the medieval Icelandic Commonwealth. These findings confirm narratives found in Bishop Thorlaker's Legends of Saints from the early 13th century, which mentioned similar structures. According to these texts, one such cave collapsed with 12 bulls inside, a testament to their use and significance during that period. Eyewitnesses from the archaeological team expressed their amazement at the size and sophistication of the cave system. According to their accounts, the interconnected caverns date back to between 800 and 1060 AD, aligning with the Viking Age. This period was a time of significant settlement and development in Iceland, and these caves provide a tangible connection to that era. The discovery goes beyond mere historical interest. Scientists are now pondering the broader implications of this find. Could there be more such structures hidden beneath Iceland's surface? What do these caves tell us about the lives of the early settlers in Iceland? And how did they manage to construct such complex structures with the limited technology available to them at the time? As excavation and research continue, more secrets hidden beneath the Icelandic landscape may come to light, each adding a new piece to the puzzle of this fascinating island nation's past. However, it also poses potential risks. The possibility of these caves harboring unknown pathogens or hazardous materials from the Viking era cannot be ruled out, posing a health risk to those exploring them. Additionally, the stability of these ancient structures is a primary concern, especially considering their age and the fact that they were only recently discovered. There is a risk of collapse, which could be dangerous not only for researchers working on site, but also for the surrounding environment. Furthermore, the exploitation of these resources could lead to ecological disturbances and heightened geopolitical tensions over resource claims in the region. The theory of Icelandia, a submerged continent that could extend from Greenland to Europe, if proven true, would challenge long-held beliefs about the composition of the Earth's crust in the North Atlantic area. The presence of a continental crust under Iceland, as opposed to an oceanic crust, could imply untapped resources, including minerals and hydrocarbons. It would also suggest that a large portion of land, previously thought to be oceanic crust, is actually continental crust. This has implications for our understanding of Earth's geological history, particularly the breakup of the supercontinent Pangaea. Experts argue that such a discovery could lead to a re-evaluation of the North Atlantic region's geological formation. Geologists and environmental scientists are particularly concerned about the potential impact of these discoveries. If the Icelandia hypothesis is confirmed, it could lead to aggressive resource exploration activities 
in a region that is already facing the brunt of climate change. Experts warn that any disruption to the already fragile ecological balance could have unforeseen consequences. Experts argue that such a discovery could lead to a re-evaluation of the North Atlantic region's geological formation. Geophysicists are intrigued by the potential for new mineral and hydrocarbon resources, if Icelandia is confirmed. However, they also warn of the environmental impact of exploiting these resources. The exploration and extraction processes could disrupt the fragile ecosystems in the North Atlantic, a concern echoed by environmental scientists. The supporters of the Icelandia theory have faced skepticism from some geologists, who argue that more evidence is needed to substantiate such a significant claim. They emphasize the need for further seismic studies and deep-sea drilling to confirm the presence of continental crust in this region. However, disturbing the ocean bed in search of resources could detrimentally affect the marine ecosystems and biodiversity in the North Atlantic region. From an ecological standpoint, this might result in irreversible damages. Let's move away from the ocean and come to the acute issue at hand. Iceland, an island nation in the North Atlantic, stands as an example of Earth's fiery power. This country, at 103,000 km square, is the youngest landmass on the planet. The landscape of Iceland is a striking blend of many geographic features. While the interior is dominated by the massive Vatnajökull glacier, the largest in Europe, the terrain is a mix of waterfalls, geysers, black sand beaches, and lava fields reflecting the volcanic activity that has shaped the island. Iceland's volcanic activity is due to its unique position situated between the Mid-Atlantic Ridge, where the Eurasian and North American tectonic plates meet. This geological hotspot is the source of constant seismic and volcanic activity, making Iceland a living laboratory for geologists. One of the most significant volcanic events in Iceland's recent history was the eruption of Ejef Jalajökull in 2010. This eruption gained worldwide attention as the enormous ash cloud it produced disrupted air travel across Europe for several weeks. The impact was global, affecting millions of travelers and causing substantial economic loss. Which is why what has emerged now in Iceland has scientists terrified. But Ejafjallajökull is just one of many notable volcanoes in Iceland. Others include Hekla, known as the gateway to hell in medieval times, and Katla, a highly active volcano hidden beneath the Myrtles Jökull glacier. There's also Grimsvatn, Iceland's most frequently erupting volcano, located beneath the Vatnajökull glacier. The volcanoes of Iceland are not only agents of destruction, but also of creation. The geothermal energy they provide is a significant source of power and heat for the nation. This energy powers homes, businesses, and attractions like the Blue Lagoon, a world-famous geothermal spa. Iceland's volcanoes have also played a role in shaping the island's culture and folklore, stories, and legends inspired by the fiery mountains, and their eruptions are woven into the fabric of Icelandic history. Despite its sparse population, Iceland's volcanic activity has far-reaching implications. Volcanic eruptions can affect air travel, contribute to climate change, and even alter global weather patterns. Scientists closely monitor these volcanoes to understand their behavior better, and to provide warnings of potential eruptions, safeguarding both Iceland's inhabitants and the broader international community. Iceland's relationship with its volcanoes is a complex interplay of awe, respect, and scientific intrigue. These natural giants are a constant reminder of the planet's dynamic nature and the deep impact geological forces can have on human civilization. Speaking geologically, volcanoes aren't the only the only significant part of the country's history. The discovery of interconnecting caves near the town of Adi, dating back to the Viking Age, 800-1060 AD, has provided valuable insights into medieval Icelandic history. Archaeologists note the significance of these findings in understanding the settlement patterns and daily lives of the Vikings. The recent geological findings present a complex scenario of ecological, environmental, and geological implications, demanding careful examination and forecasting. The discovery of the Viking-era caves near Adi brings forth concerns about geological stability. There is tension that increased human activity, coupled with natural erosion, could potentially lead to cave collapses. Such events could not only destroy these invaluable historical sites, but also pose significant risks to nearby settlements. Preserving these caves is therefore seen as important not just for their historical value, but also for environmental safety. In response to the startling geological discoveries in Iceland, Icelandic authorities and the global scientific community have implemented a range of proactive measures. 
these strategies are designed to monitor, understand, and mitigate any potential risks associated with these phenomena. The approach is multifaceted, involving ongoing monitoring efforts, emergency planning, and international cooperation. One of the primary strategies is the continuous monitoring of geological activity. The Icelandic Meteorological Office plays a key role in this, utilizing a network of seismographs, GPS stations, and other sensor equipment to track volcanic and seismic activities. These technologies enable real-time data collection and analysis, crucial for early warning systems. In addition, satellite imagery and aerial surveillance are used to monitor changes in the landscape, such as the formation of new volcanic fissures or the shifting of tectonic plates. The Icelandic authorities have also developed comprehensive emergency plans in collaboration with civil defense agencies. These plans include evacuation procedures, public awareness campaigns, and coordination with local and international emergency services. The goal is to ensure that communities living in geologically active areas are prepared and can respond effectively in the event of an eruption or other geological hazards. Another significant aspect of the response is international collaboration. Icelandic scientists work closely with counterparts from around the world, sharing data and research findings. This collaboration extends to institutions like the United Nations, the European Space Agency, and various geological and meteorological organizations. By pooling resources and expertise, the global scientific community aims to deepen its understanding of Iceland's unique geology and its implications for the rest of the world. Finally, there is an emphasis on sustainable and responsible tourism in response to these geological phenomena. With the increase in visitors drawn to Iceland's unique landscapes, authorities are working to ensure that tourism activities do not negatively impact these sensitive geological sites. This involves regulating access to certain areas, promoting eco-friendly tourism practices, and educating visitors about the importance of preserving these natural wonders.